What's up guys? Halo Boy Vash here today and we have the Veer Huck, I think it's a T915 drone. It can uh, do inverted flights. I don't know yet, I haven't flown it. I don't know if it will automatically switch, but uh, I know on our controller here that uh, you can press this button to flip it left and this button to flip it right for flight inversion. Um, I think this left and you press it in on the controller here is your speeds and this should be your flips and one of these is headless and one's return home but we'll figure it out the rest of these are all trims and let's go ahead and get it up in there and see how it does plug your battery in up and down to bind it Okay, let's see if it inverts on its own. No, it doesn't. So, now let's see. Yep, you have to do a button press to invert it. That was the right button press. It's full y'all pitch. Roll. Let's see, there's one. There's two. And there's three. So it's nothing too aggressive. It's going to be a pretty smooth flyer from the looks of it. Try that again with the rolls. Press it one time and it flips over. Press it again, right back over. So that's actually going to be pretty neat. Uh, for example, if you was to land upside down on a house, you can just flip your button and uh, take right back off. Let's see if you impress uh, this middle. Got a little breeze pushing on it. There's, there's two flips. Maybe you can keep holding it. Let's try it. Yep, as long as you hold it, it's going to continue to flip. Actually, a very nice little flyer. And let's see if it has uh, how this headless mode works. So let's see. This top button here. Yep, that is our headless. I don't like that mode, it always throws me off. The headless does work. So let's see the one key return. Ooh. Nope. It's trying to go south. It thinks south is that direction. Let's turn headless off. Okay. Thinking south over here, so let's uh, let's redo this. Land you here. Turn my controller off. Plug the battery. Let's try to keep it all straight. North, or what I'm going to call north. Okay, now when I hit the return to home, my north bearing should be this way, and it should come directly back towards me. 
should. Let's see what it does. There we go. You calibrate these gyros, they're kind of not very level here. But you can hold to the outside corners. You can't see this, but it will flash and that'll recalibrate everything. Might need a little bit of trimming too. I believe that's just the breeze pushing it. But back into headless mode. Put it over here, not too far. Hit the return home and see it will just come directly south towards you. So make sure when you bind it, if you choose to use that mold, you put your battery in and your controller, make sure it's all in one bearing and stay that way. And there you have it guys, the Veerhook T915, lights are blinking, batteries are about to go out, and thanks for watching, bye.